Well, here we are. It's been a while. So I've been a bit slack, but we had a few caravan shows on in Adelaide and doing handovers one a day at the moment. So been very busy, but I thought I'd jump on here. I actually got a gentleman that's quite interested in this model. Um, was looking at an urban and obviously you can get you one of these within three months at the moment with Great Aussie and it is a cracker of a product. Some of the features and benefits you, you'll only get on a Great Aussie at the moment, which is really good. These guys have taken it to the next level, especially in the back end here of uh, 2023. They've listened to what we've told them, what you guys are asking for and they've gone above and beyond. So this beast is a aluminium frame uh, Explorer with a limited edition pack, which there's their latest pack, which has pretty much got all the bells and whistles on it. But what makes this thing really special is the chassis, which is done by a company uh, in Melbourne called Intelligent Engineering. So not a new company. Well, it is a new company, but part of a division of tough ride suspension which we all know with great aussie obviously they've been a partnership with them for a while and they've obviously partnered up with these guys to build this new chassis so what sort of makes it different obviously you can see there it's got no wheel arch um, there but this has uh, got aluminium inserts into it uh, which are all laser cut um, and there's a few other key features as well which I'll, uh, I'll run you through. So a lot of this video is going to be on the outside because uh, it is it is something pretty special. So straight away on the front, I know it all looks pretty standard, but we've got the DO35 there, but what's kind of neat is this uh, plate. So traditionally most vans will have the jockey wheel mount welded on, yeah? Whereas, as you can see here, these are all bolts. So it allow you to chop and change your jockey wheel and also you not have to grind to, to get it off. And decent, you know, bracing plate for it bolted onto as well. Probably could do with a sidewinder jockey wheel, which would probably change on this one. But yeah, that's a nice feature. Obviously, recess coupling, which is pretty standard sort of stuff. Um, but another cool feature you'll see under there. Have a look at the little bash plate, a little uh, stone guard they put underneath. This is a really neat feature. And then moving along. Have a look at this. So, this is all aluminium, guys. Yeah, so that's laser cut aluminium. But what makes this neat is it allows you to get access to your tanks on the other side. Obviously, not this side, all your outlets and inlets are on the other side. But yeah, it allows you to get access to your tanks just by un undoing these you know, Allen key nuts here. You can get access to all the sides so you don't have to take off all the checker plate armor underneath. So, it's bloody smart very clever you know, and then there's just some little things have a look at you know most most chassis you know you'll find the, the tap for the a-frame there it'll just be a pipe running along the chassis just not protected so that one's you know it's recessed in the pipe you can see goes in so good again now obviously with great aussie this is an alloy frame one so it's also got the the fiberglass floor as well so nice and strong underneath but of course it does have the checker plate armor under it too so yeah a very cool feature obviously this has got the bug lighting anything gravity and above you get the bug lighting as well check out these new rims so you can order these in bronze or black um, these ones also this has got the mickey thompson tires on it i believe currently they're out of stock of those so they're fitting coopers but they should be back in stock if you actually you know you really request to have mickey thompson's but obviously cooper tire a good quality tire as well so 196 what is she and this is what's making it stand out too, guys, yeah? So this is a, a 19.6 full off-road. It's got a tear weight of 682, a ball weight of 130, and of course, ATM three and a half. So, you know, plenty of plenty of payload for sure. Obviously, you can make it higher, but uh, the your ATM if you want, but you shouldn't really need it. Obviously, I go on about this, but the checker plate tunnel boot's really nice too. So yeah, your main decal difference, it's a 1906 Explorer, but you'll see the Limited on there. So that shows all the extras that you get in the Limited pack. Panning around the back, you get a nice little wood basket as well, which is handy. You don't have to use it for wood, use it for whatever you want, but yeah, that's a nice feature too. Obviously you got the floodlight up there as well. And what sets this one apart too is, have a look at that, it's on a rear cutaway. 
So the whole back end slanted, and of course that's got checker plate on it as well. So very nice, and you see like just things like that. Look at the, the out, the inlet for the shower. That's the shower uh, full pipe there going into the chassis. So that's all cut out properly. It's not hacked out. And then you've got recovery points there as well. I'm not sure when you're going to use them, but they're there. Let's jump under here and have a squeeze. So there you go, that's the tough ride suspension. I think you can obviously option this up with airbags if you want to as well. Um, but you can see there's there's next to nothing there guys, yeah, it's all completely all sealed up. So with this pack as well, it does now come with a uh, dedicated drinking tank on this one too. So I think it's around 280 litres in total of water storage. And just be aware, uh, you can still order this with Cruise Master as well your call but i like to think the fact that you know the intelligent engineering make this chassis order it with the suspension that they build which is the tough ride you can see on there their efs shock so they're a decent quality shock too all right let's jump in and have a squeeze we can close the door nice and quiet So yeah, for a 19.6, still plenty of room. This one's in a cafe. Uh, you can do a reverse layout on this one. This one probably works a little bit better because it does have the pantry there as well. So that's a full height pantry. And I've been clever with the design with this. You know, the basket's down the bottom and it still gives you a shelf at the top. You know, put your Wheaties, your Fruit Loops, whatever takes your fancy. Now obviously standard with a full size oven as well. And latest feature too, as of 2023, is the strip lighting around the overheads. You see around the bed there as well. And then also under the cabinets at the bottom, which look really schmick. So you can toggle these on and off, yeah? Which I've been in the yard at night time with these on. They look really good just leaving those ones on. So obviously all inner fiberglass uh, on the inside. Compressor fridge is standard. No charges for extra for that. Obviously black plaque too, so you can see all the black handles and black seam. Uh, it's got the twin, it's got the mixer, so you don't have to have the separate filter. So the dedicated tank runs off the, the mixer at the back. Cubby holes. Obviously, I go on about this too, but the banks of drawers are great. Obviously give you really good value for money. Obviously it's got the wireless lighting too that these guys use. And, uh, this one's a cafe seat, but you can order it with a um, L shape if you want. I'll give you a look. I've got a little picture, but I'll give you a peek. So with the limited edition pack with this, it comes with the Enerdrive RV80 board and the 2600 watt inverter as well. You can option it up with two of these if you want, um, but DC DC charger, um, obviously the 2600 watt inverter to all points including the ac and this has also got 800 watts of solar on the roof so i can hear this thing powering along here we've got good sun today um, the fans purring away so yeah plenty of solar 800 watts of solar can definitely handle the uh, extra battery if you want to fit one of those two as well so into the ensuite obviously it's got the black the black sink and then the front load washing machine and the outside storage lockers down the bottom there on the outside too this has got the neat little mirror which everyone loves with the magnifier and then it glows that doesn't do it justice in the camera you'll have to come and have a look guys to see it in person because it looks really good black uh, taps and that in there as well so obviously at the door um, you'll find the uh, inner drive set up so this has got the the epro gauge as well as the uh the switch there to turn your inverter on and off and of course this is like i said it's got the two drinking tanks so you've got dedicated one to the filtered water tap and then one to your other 200 liter fresh and there of course just your water tank gauge ones at the top there and that's your well, these are all your wireless lighting banks so i think i've shown you this before but all great aussies come with wireless lighting too so at night time you can just push the remote and change all these banks of lights as well so this girl 
can uh, can find a new home you're able to buy this one off the floor um, I do need one for the full drive show coming up in a couple of months so if you were to take this one I'd need to know pretty quickly but so I could get another one ordered for that show but otherwise we can still get you one of these great Aussies before Christmas guys so yeah definitely definitely not hard to come by no 12 months wait on one of these and just be aware like obviously the the name's not known but this has got a seven year structural warranty on it guys yeah so um you don't need to worry about anything you know structurally going wrong with the van obviously all your other bits and pieces your windows your your you know microwave your air conditioner all of them are covered by their own warranty but i really like the fact you know the company is pretty much saying hey we're going to put a seven year structural warranty on it and it's classified as an off-road van so you know they're, they're backing their product to say it's going to last it's built well you know and i've talked about this before with you know aluminium frame i'm sure a lot of my customers that have bought a van from me know i rabbit on about this but you know outer outer fiberglass inner rhs aluminium and then inner fiberglass yeah guys you can have water pissing out of this vent nothing's going to rot yeah you know it hits the floor you know that's that's also a fiberglass honeycomb floor as well so yeah look i really like the product these guys are going leaps and bounds um and i get nothing but positive feedback i've been looking on the owners groups lately and uh you know people taking these vans to crazy places even gravity the one down from this so come and have a look at great aussie's latest chassis i mean obviously this guys this is not a this isn't a cheap van by any means it's uh it's around one hundred and twenty thousand dollars. um but the uh you know the chassis the alloy frame the anadrive stuff the, the the draw runners the compressor fridge 800 watts of solar it's got everything i mean look at the size of these windows too they're massive huge windows anyway thanks for watching i will try and get some more content up i do have a lot of new vans in the yard i need to get uploaded for you to have a look at have a good day like share subscribe